Well, Legends, you, you gave us nothing. Absolutely nothing. Everyone was waiting to see who's the new LF, who's it gonna be, and you guys really just said, uh, nah, not, not, not this week. You guys are gonna have to wait a whole nother week to see who that LF is, so guess we'll be waiting another week to find out who that is. Also, I know a lot of people were saying, oh, what about LF Fist Coup from the Broly movie, because we're getting the Broly raid. And uh, yeah, that is a that is like a possibility, you know, that I guess is probably a good idea because of the raid that I didn't mention. So there's him too. Uh, uh, my opinions on that, I would be that would be super boring in my opinion. Like uh, any, the only LF Goku's that I'd be like excited about at this point would be Master Ultra Instinct, obviously, and then also Super Saiyan God if he got an LF. So otherwise, all the other Goku's are pretty boring to me because there's like so many Goku's to get LFs. It's kind of like kind of boring but whatever i know loads of people love goku so that is what that is we're going to talk about the like the two things that are worth mentioning from this update in dragon ball legends one of them is like a quick like two second thing we'll do it right here now that is the uh the extreme clash raid versus legendary super saiyan broly we know we've got it on the way it's coming on the 13th so friday get ready run the raid we'll get uh you can get the z power for the broly you know the new broly that they have and then also the battle medals so you can get your cc you know raid medals that's what they are so all that good stuff but then let's get to the point of this video and i guess this is going to be a short video but this this is the big news i guess from the thing this comes out also on friday and it's only around for the same amount of time as the raid so it's not it's only for the weekend really as you can see from the 13th to the 16th and it is our good old Sporking Limit Break banner, ladies and gentlemen. Yep. Yeah, I recommend you do this. Every time it comes out, I recommend you do this because you are guaranteed, as you can see on the uh, final step here, you're guaranteed 600 LFZ pie. 600 LFZ pie. That's nothing to, you know, scoff at. That's a whole, that's like pulling a copy of the LF. So if you want whoever the new athlete is going to be, whether the LF is in fact the Fist Coup or it turns out to be one of the other people I mentioned in my video, which if you haven't seen, go check it out. But if it turns out to be any of those people and you want them or you think you might want them, even if you don't want them, but you want some other LFZ power, do this banner as you can see. It costs, was it 3,000? That's 500, 1K, 1.5, 2K, you have 3,000 CC and you get 600 LFZ power as well as six, no, what is that? 800 and uh, 1,000. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it says 1,000 on it somewhere. Oh, no, it doesn't. Well, you get 1,000 normal Z-Power as well, alongside your 600 LF Z-Power. So, huge, huge, great value banner. I mean, most of the units you can pull on it, there's a list. Like, it's just the old kind of LFs, Beerus, Goten, which he did just get a Zenkai. We got Gohan, Namiku, the Super Saiyan 3, Vegeta, the blue one, who... Uh, that'd be cool if he got a Zenkai. I mean, Goten just got one, so I think it'll be a little while till we get another LF. And then also Super Vegito, which means, like, I would love that. All the Super Vegito, I can already tell this dude's gonna be broken. Absolutely broken when he does get a Zenkai, but that'd be cool. But yeah, it's like a bunch of old kind of units. I think it's only units from, like, before second anniversary, or including second anniversary, because it's the, all of these guys, well, not Vegito Blue, but the other non-LS from the second anniversary, and then, like, before that date on the banner, so... You know if you want any more copies of them but the main thing you're going for here is the z power and you should do it because okay let's just say in this scenario here that we get lf fist coup or lf cell and you really want one of those two like you just super wanna well yes it's going to cost you 3000 cc here and you'd be, be like well I, I i don't have as many chances then on that banner yes but if you do in fact happen to pull you know, with however much CC you spend on the new LF banner that'll be coming out next week. I don't, it's like next week guaranteed, basically. So if you pull them, then you already have one copy. Ba bam You use the Z power. It's like pulling another copy, which you're not guaranteed. Like, trust me, I am well aware you're not guaranteed LFs. Well, I guess technically you are now with the whole pity system, but that's a lot of CCs. And if you're worried about 3,000, you're not going for that pity number, that's for sure. But yeah, so I mean, also I want to have. Has anyone used the pity to get Frieza yet? I, I have. I didn't bother summoning for Frieza because I don't run LOE. But like, has anyone used the pity system to get Frieza yet? I'd be interested if you have. Let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, do this. You're if you pull them one time because you have to pull them one time. You have to pull them one time. You're then guaranteed essentially a second copy. Or you don't want the new LF. You can go use it on Gogeta Blue UI, whatever LF you currently already have that you want to add more stars to. So you, again, you have to have the unit already, 
But if you have them already, then you can use it and you can increase their star number to, you know, whatever it is you want. Say you have Goten, and even with the free Z power we're gonna get for Goten, you don't have enough to give him seven stars, bam, here you go. Well, I guess you could pull him actually while you're summoning, but if you don't pull him, then bam, there you go. You can now Zenkai Goten if that's something you want to do. So these banners always just absolutely world class. You always should summon on it. I mean, just for the Z power, you always should summon on it. So that's really it. I just thought I'd let you guys know that. Uh, again, not a whole lot going on with this. It's really like a dead week, I guess, in terms of update, you know, the weekly update going on. But uh, we have the raid coming up. Let's get ready for that, plan for that. We got this banner, plan for that. And uh, I guess we'll keep our eyes peeled for any more hints about that new LF, who it might be. But that's gonna do it. The video helped you out. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Appreciate it when you guys press that big red beautiful button and hit the bell if you want notifications for every time I post a video. That's, that's it, that's gonna do it. Hope y'all are staying happy and healthy, having the best of days out there, and I'll catch y'all tomorrow. <laughs>